Well, hello, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Rudy and thank you so much for being here and I hope that you like snails. <laughs> I recently realized that I have an excessive amount of products that include snail mucin in them and how often I actually use them in my skincare routine and I wanted to share some of my favorites it's definitely not necessary to have quite as many as I have, but you guys know I get a lot of products from skincare companies. I try a lot of different things. So I wanted to share a few different brands uh, at different price points. And also that includes some different ingredients to kind of mix it up depending on how sensitive your skin is or what your skin goals are. If you are new here, welcome to my channel. Like I said, my name is Rudy and we talk about more than just snail juice on this channel. We talk about skincare, acne, mental health. We do vlogs. We talk about Target fashion. I'm basically trying to become a miniature Jessica Braun, so I would love to have you subscribe. So first let's talk about snail mucin and kind of what it is, how it's extracted. I know there's like a lot of confusion around it. I will say all of the brands that we're talking about today are cruelty free. Obviously they're not vegan because this is a uh, snail juice coming from their bottoms not from their bottoms, it's not poop. Ugh. It's the goo, you know? It's really not um, as pleasant as of an idea as it is inside the product, so we'll get to that. So here's the thing, um, people say that the most beneficial parts of snail mucin come when they are stressed, um, but as mentioned, these are cruelty-free brands, therefore what they say they do to get the mucin. So for example, CauseRx is one that we're going to talk about. Also, sorry, I have on a Band-Aid in all of the product shots because I am just a very fancy professional YouTuber. They claim that they basically have all of the snails in a very quiet, dark room and they just let them slither around on like little sheets and then they take those sheets and make the products from the mucin. So they're not put under stress and they're not killed for their snail mucin, but they aren't being stressed, which makes me think, okay, maybe the secretion isn't as good as if they were stressed, but I also don't wanna use a stressed out snail goo on my face because I feel like that's bad karma. I'm getting a little off track here. Obviously this was sort of originated in the K-beauty world in Korean skincare, and it's been brought over to Western skincare. I would say within the past few years, if you asked me about snail mucin, like five years ago, I would have absolutely no idea. And now I have a plethora of products. So the main two benefits of snail mucin for me is the delivery of moisture and the soothing of my sensitive skin. I feel like you cannot hear snail mucin without sensitive skin in the same sentence. It's amazing for sensitized skin as well. And I would say most of the time, snail mucin products are going to come in a form that are very hydrating, like a toner or a lightweight moisturizer. And they usually won't include any active ingredients or acne fighting ingredients because snail mucin is kind of the star ingredient in most of these products. We're going to look at a toner, moisturizer, mask, a couple serums, and a sheet mask today. I will say a lot of these deliver the same sort of sensation for me, but maybe in a different format. So it's kind of up to you to decide what you like most or to try it all out because honestly, I love using all of these within my routine. All right, so first let's talk about a more recent favorite of mine, which is the Peach Slices line. I also wanna preface by saying all of the products that I share today will also be fragrance and essential oil free, so you don't need to worry about that. Super safe for sensitive skin. So this is the Snail Rescue line from Peach Slices. It comes with a toner, a lightweight moisturizer, and the star of the show, in my opinion, an intensive wash off mask. The Snail Mucin Toner is a blemish busting toner with 95% snail mucin concentrate. It's said to fast track your skin to hydrated blemish free skin and an even glow with snail mucin. The toner helps clear pores, zap zits, and strengthen the skin's barrier. This is a super duper lightweight, very hydrating, very moisturizing toner with a very small ingredient list with snail secretion filtrate being the number one ingredient on the list with hyaluronic acid and centella asiatica being some of the other ingredients within this product. If you have irritated skin and you are oily, I think that you would love this. I would put this on damp skin right when you get out of the shower and then top it off with your favorite moisturizer. Doesn't need to be a snail moisturizer to help lock in some extra moisture. And if you're dealing with irritation, 
it can help tackle that as well. I also wanna mention that snail's accretion is great for acne prone skin types to help with that inflammation. I don't think necessarily it's great at fighting acne on its own. However, if you have very mild acne, this will do wonders for you. It is a fan favorite of a lot of different people, but if you're not a fan of toners in general, let's talk about the moisturizer. So this is the Snail Rescue All-in-One Oil-Free Moisturizer, again, with 95% snail mucin concentrate. Very similar description on the packaging here. Even glow with snail mucin, weightless moisturizer, quenches thirsty skin, zaps it, and, and minimizes shine. Absolutely great for oily skin. If you are dry or even combo, this is not going to be enough for you. I would consider myself to be an oily skin person, but even this is not quite enough for me. I would say that the consistency is almost like a serum rather than a moisturizer. So here is a little, you can see how quickly it just turns into a liquid. You know, in fact, it kind of reminds me of uh, last video I talked about the La Roche Posay fluid moisturizer. It pretty much reminds me of that and how the minute that you put it on your skin, it turns into a, basically a serum or liquid. And for me in the summer, that's enough underneath a good SPF, but it's not enough on its own. So just keep that in mind. However, if you are incredibly oily and acne prone and you need something lightweight to put under an SPF, I think you would really like this. There's a little bit more involved in this ingredient list but again snail secretion filtrate is the first ingredient we have centella again hyaluronic acid strawberry fruit extract which that strawberry fruit extract not an essential oil and honestly there's nothing that crazy outside of this it's great for oily acne prone skin as i've mentioned incredibly lightweight oil free so it's not going to clog your pores i like this don't love it once i go through it i'll probably just stick with using the toner just because they are so similar in ingredients and i find that i need an extra moisturizer on top of this anyways but they are a great pair especially in the summer if you are oily lastly my favorite Favorite product in their line. This is the Snail Rescue Intensive Wash Off Mask with 95% snail mucin concentrate. Could you believe it? Again, same sort of packaging of what it's going to do for you. So you really don't need to purchase all three of these products. And if you're looking to kind of dip your toes into the snail mucin world, I would totally recommend this because it is a wash off mask and you can decide if you really like it before using a product that will stay on your skin. Super duper similar ingredient list to the moisturizer. However, we've got some extra goodies in here, including licorice root extract, which is great for sensitivity skin again snail secretion filtrate and hyaluronic acid the strawberry fruit extract the reason that I like this beyond the fact that it is silicone free fragrance free alcohol free cruelty free is the actual consistency of this product is incredibly unique it feels like slime it feels like slimy jelly and I'm not typically someone who uses a mask that is hydrating and moisturizing usually if I'm going in with a mask it is a clay style mask or a exfoliating mask to help with my acne, but every once in a while to use a hydrating mask, in fact, you can use this every single day. It just makes your skin feel plump without adding too much hydration, which could lead to breakouts because you are washing it off. Again, I use this in the shower and you can leave it on for up to 15 minutes or longer. It doesn't dry down. Very hydrating, moisturizing, feels so beautiful when it comes off the skin and it's just the most unique mask I have ever tried. If you're going to pick something up from the Peach Slices line, I definitely recommend this mask. Next, let's Let's talk about CauseRx, which I would consider to be like the grandfather of snail mucin in the skincare community. And I feel like most people know CauseRx for their snail secretion 96% product that everyone loves. I also love, I got my mom onto it. But recently I decided to branch out from that original product and try two other products within that same line and I am totally in love with both of them. I think I've mentioned both, if not one of these in a favorites or a summer skincare routine before, definitely the moisturizer, but let's talk about this dual essence. To me, this is more of a serum than an essence, but it is one of the most unique serums I've ever tried simply for the fact that it is an actual dual product with two different serums on each side that mix together. So this side here, the clear side, is the typical 96% snail mucin from their line that everyone loves. And this side is a radiance serum that has 5% niacinamide. So basically you are getting a mixture of a low grade percentage amount of niacinamide, enough to make a difference, but not to irritate your skin, along with a pump of the snail secretion. Let me show you what this looks like. It's a huge bottle and honestly, it will take you forever to go through it. 
You can kind of see how it's like a white mixture within the clear regular snail secretion. Feels incredibly similar to their normal snail secretion product, but it just adds that extra oomph of niacinamide. So if you were looking to help brighten your skin, also niacinamide works great with tretinoin. You could use this product or any of these products with tretinoin to help brighten your skin and help with irritation. If you don't do well with niacinamide, I would skip this one and just go with their original formulation, but I just like it. It's something different. It has 2.7 ounces in it. I mean, I've been using this forever and I've barely made a dent in it. I just love CauseRx. I think their products are amazing and their snail secretion filtrate is awesome. Lastly from CauseRx, let's talk about their Advanced Snail 92 All-in-One Cream. I picked this up with my sister in Tallahassee when we were shopping together, kind of on a whim, and I'm really glad that I did. It is basically their snail filtrate in a moisturizer form. And I do like this product, but it is very strange. It's so goopy. I mean, so goopy that for some reason when I look at it, I'm like, I don't want that. I don't want to use that. But every time that I do use it, I like it, if that makes sense. I think it's because it just looks like icing. It looks like cake icing. But when you put it on, it's not sticky whatsoever. It's just sticky. It's just got that like gooey center vibes because of the snail secretion filtrate that's in there, which is a good thing. There's 92% in here. And if again, you're not a fan of toners or essences or anything like that, but you still want the benefits of a snail of a snail, I would recommend getting the moisturizer. I wish that it was in a pump like this instead of a tub because I really don't like sticking my fingers in it. It kind of makes a little bit of a mess, but it's super lightweight. I would say it's better for oily skin or summertime, but I could use this underneath my SPF and I feel like it would be enough. Definitely a fan of this. I need to bust it out more often because I've just been trying to go through my La Roche Posay for the summer but I will definitely be using this one next. I really, really love CauseRx. I love this line, and I feel like you can't go wrong with any of these products or the Peach Slices products. They're both amazing. Last but certainly not least is the brand Benton. They have one specific holy grail snail product that I used over the CauseRx for a long time, and that is the Snail Bee High Content Essence. I talked about this in a Korean beauty for sensitive skin video. It was one of my earliest videos that I ever made. I'll link that up above. This stuff is the bomb. It is a little bit confusing because not only does it have snail concentrate in it, but it also has bee venom and niacinamide. And whenever I tell people that it has bee venom in it, they're like, and you have sensitive skin, how is that gonna work? And it works similarly to the snail mucin in the sense that the bee venom actually draws the cells in your skin to go to that area and heal it as if there was a wound there even though there isn't. So it kind of tricks your skin and it's actually amazing for sensitive skin. This is my husband's favorite skincare product. It is in all of the videos that I've done with him. He loves it, he uses it every single morning. He just loves the feeling of it and I will say this is definitely the lightest weight of the products that we've shown so far in terms of serums. It's just so watery and beautiful let's see here it's got a thicker consistency when it comes to the actual serum it's going to hold together a little bit better but once you blend it in it is so lightweight so juicy it's just a beautiful texture it's probably my favorite texture of all of the ones here honestly i love CauseRx, but the CauseRx one is a little bit too I don't know, thick for me. And I just prefer the Benton formula and the way that it feels a lot more. And secondarily, if you don't like using a serum or you don't wanna incorporate it into your routine every night and you're not interested in like kind of the mask that goes all over your face, we have sheet masks of the Snail Bee High Content Essence. Again, we have snail secretion filtrate, bee venom, a ton of other extracts in here that are great for the skin. So these come in individual mask packs, which makes them really easy for travel. And all it is is a two-piece face mask that you can put on, leave it on for as long as you want, and get the benefits of basically having this serum in a mask, and use it whenever you'd like if you wanna relax. It's basically just another vehicle for this product, but I I love sheet masks and sometimes it's just fun to relax with one on, especially knowing that again, 
It's oil-free, fragrance-free, alcohol-free, good for sensitive skin, and helps heal any bacterial wounds or acne that you may have. So these are a very, very unique blend of ingredients. I really like them. It's very innovative, and I just love Benton as a brand. I know that was a lot of products, but I just kind of wanted to give you a breakdown of each of them so you could decide what may be best for you. If you have other snail filtrate products that I didn't mention here that you love, please leave them down below because obviously I love the snails. Happy to answer any questions you guys may have on these in the comments and I will see you in the next video really soon. Bye.